Hello you guys and welcome back to my walkthrough for Mass Effect 3. Today we are going to continue on to more space travel. I want to thank you guys so much for all the support that you've shown with this series. I hope you're enjoying watching me play. And like I said before, I'm trying to get the best experience for those who are unfamiliar with the Mass Effect series. As you can see today, we're going to be doing more so, uh, space travel. Because we do have some more side missions or assignments. Oh shoot, we're low on fuel again. found something. Okay, let's hurry up and uh, get this. Ooh, 650. Okay, can we make it to the mass relay? Successful. Good. Okay, so I think that we went to the Athena Nebula last time. Let's go ahead and start at the top here. Oh no, it's 100%. We'll go to this system first. And I think that this is part se six or seven of space travel. So I have done quite a bit. Uh, let's save that last scan for when we come back. Over to Paz. Signal confirmed. Oh, jeez. So many Reapers. Okay, let's uh, start the scanner. Now, for these space travel missions or videos I've explained before, I don't really want to edit them out. Like, I'm <laughs> sorry, that was Brody. I don't have to. Prothean data drives, nice. I don't have to edit them as much as the Mass Effect 2 videos. Because with the Mass Effect 2 videos, basically it was just uh, like mining or scanning. I, I don't want to get hit by this Reaper. That was close. Eluded. But yeah, so far the last two videos have been awesome assignment missions. We've gone to the Ardat Yakshi Monastery. I found something. Ugh. And uh, in the episode before that, we met Jacob with the Cerberus scientists. I think some of these are Basically just going to be finishing some Citadel assignments. Emergency fuel pods. War asset acquired. Mm. Oh, that is so close. Shoot. Faster than light jump successful. There's still something there. Evasion ah. Okay, Papers they're just too fast. Um, let's try one more time. Okay, so I'm not finding the last piece of that system. I think I'll just end up coming back. That way I don't have to deal with the Reapers. As you can see, there's one more thing in that system because we're only at 66%. 
Yeah, what's this? Hmm. Evasion successful. Damn. I hate those reapers. Now we have to do a mission before we can go back there. Hmm. Apparently there's a system here, but we can't go yet. The Ninma cluster. Now I have to say that I like the journal. What is this? Listening post. I like the journal better in Mass Effect 2 because in Mass Effect 3. Oh, jeez. Uh, it doesn't really update your. Uh, like the mission that you're on. It doesn't update the summary. So sometimes it just feels like you don't really know what's going on. Okay, so that's just weird. Can we still scan any planet? No. But why is there nothing in this system? Unless we end up coming back. I love how planets hide. Like this one. <laughs> kind of like in a meteor shower. Okay, we'll do one more scan over here and then move on. Hopefully more happens in this episode. Let's get some fuel. Ah, oh, we went to the listening post earlier. Okay, so maybe there's just nothing here. Oh no. <laughs> he spawned right next to the mass relay. Faster than light jump Oh successful. boy, that was way too close. Hey you guys. Um Cerberus Fighter Base, let's go there. At least I want to get something in this video. I don't want it just to be me kind of running around space with my head cut off. Oh, back to Novaria. We went to Novaria where we found Matriarch Benezia in Mass Effect 1. So let's go ahead and land. We haven't brought Garrus and Edie with us in a while, so let's go ahead and bring them. I know that we're going to have a bunch of power points to assign, or points to assign. Mm, I think for these I'm just going to keep them with what they have. Ah oh, yes, lots of points. Okay, so let me go assign them. Okay, so let me see if I remember the points that I put in. For Shepard, I put Fitness rank 5 for Shield, Recharge, and Fitness. And then we have Edie. I brought her up two ranks in Incinerate. Rank 5, Burning Damage. Rank 6, Armor Damage. As well as Overload. Rank 5 for Neural Shock and rank 6 for Shield Damage. I also put points into her decoy uh, for rank 5, which was for Shock. And her Unshackled AI rank 5 for Tech Damage. For Garrus, I put his points into... A concussive shot, rank 5 for shatter, and rank 6 for amplification. Uh, what else did I put in? I did not put it into overload. I put it into armor piercing ammo, rank 4 for damage, and rank 5 for headshots. And then I also put the rest of his points that I had available 
Um, into Turian Rebel for rank 5 Assault Rifles and rank 6 Sniper Rifles. Now I want to save up <laughs> um, more points to get his armor piercing ammo to rank 6 because once I upgrade that uh, to the, f the fullest it can go, I think I'll put it into uh, damage. And then for concussive shot, as you can see here for rank 6 amplification, the power concussive shot with the properties of active ammo power enabling it to burn, freeze, disrupt, warp, or pierce armor. So it just makes concussive shot even better because he has the armor piercing ammo. Okay, you guys. Commander, the enemy has a strategic advantage in this sector thanks to the fighter squadron facility you're about to attack. We want to seize it, but their air defenses are too strong for a frontal assault. Losses would be too cost prohibitive. How do you want me to handle this? Go in the back, bring down their defenses so we can send in the troops. Good luck, Commander. I have visual contact. There's a small platform above the main landing pad. I can drop you there, but it's got to be now. Let's do it. Keep an eye out for the Okay, sorry to interrupt you, Shepard. As you can see, this is a, a multiplayer map. Okay. Map center. Multiple contacts. I'm hoping with Garrus's upgrades. That he won't die as fast. This map uh, for multiplayer is actually one of my favorite. Moved up just a little too fast. We're gonna go ahead and throw in our sentry turret. Go ahead and move Garrus and you got Edie up as well. Enemies neutralized, Shepard. Let's find that control center. Okay, before we do that, let's go ahead and make sure that we pick up all of the extras that we can find. So it looks like we're just going to end up fighting our way back up the top. Edie do it. I'm gonna trust Garrus that he's strong Edie, enough. front and center. As you command. Be ready, Commander. You're gonna get swarmed. Commander, I've been flushed from cover. Retreating to minimum safe distance. No problem. Cortez, get out of there. We'll wait for your all clear, then relay to the strike force. Warning. Warning. Security breach. 
Just bring down their defenses. We'll worry about that later. We're just gonna stick in here. This is the best place to be, really. Keep Garrus here. Affirmative. And I will go over here. <laughs> he doesn't Shepherd, listen. It appears that shutdown requires the synchronous command. Cerberus is deploying manual defenses to the landing pad, Shepard. And that's where we need to go. We'll make our way up this way. Weekly processing report, Sergeant Parker. All on-base personnel have been processed. Interrogation protocols updated successfully. Oh, integration. Not interrogation. engineer. I don't want him setting down a turret. Yeah. Okay, let's just look at this and we'll head up to top. Concussive shot right there. Oh, for decoy, I thought it was a uh, nemesis. Cortez, I read you. Come in. There you are, Commander. Had to get through the interference. Area clear. Signaling the strike force. Wait. Scan's picking up something coming your way. Atlas. Deploying armed response. An Atlas. Terrific. Yep. Give it everything you got. Where is it? Okay. Let's go ahead and see if we can take him out and hijack him. Although I'm not sure that that's really possible. Because I know that there's only a few of them that you can hijack in the game. Seriously. Now hmm. the deck is clear, Shepard. Anyone wounded? Just the usual minor flesh wound. 
Yaris, you were taken down. Copy that, Lieutenant. This was a major victory, Commander. A crippling blow to Cerberus operations in this sector. Now all we have to do is maintain control of the facility. Cerberus won't make that easy. And we won't make it easy on them. Thanks to you, we can use their own defenses against them. Tell your team they did good, Commander. You should be proud. Thank you, sir. That's all. Hack it out. I feel good about it too, sir. So let's just head back to the galaxy map. I think once I get back there, I'm going to open my journal and see what else we can do. So we're just not wandering around aimlessly. Okay, so the Hades Nexus has a few assignments for us there. That will be the next place that we go to. How much fuel do we have? Mm, might as well just get a little bit more. Oh man. Hades. I think that's, yeah, that's the one. So the Hades Gamma System. We have two assignments here, basically just pick up and go. We're gonna have a lot of stuff to do on the Citadel once we get back. Nice. Looks like we've already kind of looked around this system before. What a pain in the ass. Evasion successful. Sometimes they just know you're there way too fast. Ah. Looks like we must have scanned this one before we got chased out of the system. Alliance Frigate Agincourt. Alliance First Fleet. We'll take it. Now over to the Dees system. I hope that there's fuel here. <laughs> oh boy. Hoping that we can just scan it. Reapers eluded. This is not good. Okay, so why is it not? Yep. Out of fuel. So I don't know what's going on there. Let's go back to the Horsehead Nebula. I know that there was a fuel depot there. I guess we're just going to go ahead and move on. I'm not sure why some of the assignments aren't coming up. We're just going to go ahead and fill, fill her up and move on to another system. Mm, 
I'm gonna go ahead and go to the ones that are not at 100%. finish them. I don't know if some of them you can't go to for a little while. Oh, look at We can go to Asgard. <laughs> what do you know? Looks like there's probably two pickups over here. Uh, of course, there's Reapers. See. Hmm. Faster than light jump successful. I don't know Evasion why some successful. of these places we cannot pick up. And we're almost out of fuel again. Okay, on to the next system, since we really can't go there until we do another mission. I just say that this is kind of getting old. <laughs> like, I know that the Reapers are invading, but my scanner just isn't picking up anything. Kashan. The Pillars of Strength. Okay, I know that that was one of the Citadel assignments. This planet almost looks uh, Earth-like. Okay. Let's see. Now it's at 100%. Okay, so we're done here. We don't need a scan again to get the Reapers mad at us. We've already gone to Hades. Let's go to the Gemini. fuel. I don't know if we can make it there. Let's try to make it. We might be able to find... Oh, shoot. No. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and cut to me getting over to the Ming system so you guys don't have to wait. <laughs> we finally made it! Signal confirmed. Nice. So, I think this is gonna be fuel. Yep. 320. Nice. I didn't fill all the way up because I figured that something was going to be here. Oh, let's hurry up and get this. Prague. You really want to go through all of the systems, try to find all the war assets. That way you have more like alliance you have a, a better alliance against the reapers so there reapers is eluded. a reason why you want to uh, scan all the systems to 100 percent for those of you who haven't played the series Look at that, it's just... Fuel? Good. 470 few units. Okay. <laughs> the Gemini Sigma system is done. Let's see if there's any other... I don't know if I went to the Attican. I probably didn't. I think in the next episode, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, go back to the Citadel. That way we can... Kind of just hang with the 
crew, they all want to meet up at the Citadel, and plus Miranda's there as well. There will be probably a couple Citadel episodes. I found something. Ooh, Pharos. This is, see, um, the Exogeny Corporation. This is where we found the... Oh, it was the Thorian. Where Shiala was. She was the one who got sucked up and <laughs> basically cloned in the Thorian. The Exogeny Scientists. Nice. Even though I think they're kind of bad. 50%. Fuel, please? <laughs> uh, 240. Nice. So, let's get out of here. Evasion successful. And go back. This is a sweet looking system with the green. I do have to say that the artists for this game really did a good job. Although I wonder what an astronomer would say about all of the star locations. I know that when the Titanic was remastered or remade like a year ago. Uh, there were some <laughs> people complaining that the stars were not in the right part of the space. I have to turn my online off. <laughs> or my notifications, I have to turn them off. Come on, scan, scan, scan. Oh shit, they're moving fast. They're like that guy. <laughs> Don't let him go. A kite's nest. Exodus cluster. I think we've already been there. The Athon cluster. Let's check that out. Hopefully it has a fuel depot there. We're running out of fuel again. Seems like your fuel deteriorates faster in Mass Effect 3. Fuck me, seriously? Uh, sorry. Man, I think I should have gone to the furthest one first. Oh well, the decision has been made. I found something. Oma Kerr. Mm, I guess this uh, planet looks more like Earth. The other one didn't look like it had water on it. Volus Intelligence Archives. Okay, so that was something that we needed for a Citadel mission. 50% of assets. We have light, fuel there. We're gonna go ahead and get back in. Uh, we Evasion wanna get successful. next to it. There we go. Nice. 250 units. I think the Reapers are Reapers moving faster. <laughs> They're moving faster on me. We need for this system now. And then come back through. Shoot. Signal confirmed. Whoa. <laughs> this is not good. A lonely world of rock and ice. That's just really sad. Wallace Engineering Team. Okay, let's get out of the system really quick. Quick. Faster than light jump Whoa. successful. <laughs> and we still have 
more scanning to do here. Evasion successful. Let's try one more time. If we can't get anything, then we'll just move on and come back some other point. Okay, Reapers doesn't look like we're going to get anything yet. I don't know if it's the game that's just not letting me scan once the Reapers come in. But it is pretty frustrating. I found something. Especially when you scan just a couple times and they're right on you. You would think that the Normandy would have a way of making it so that they can't see you as quickly. Faster than light jump successful. Okay. Evasion successful. Nothing. Nothing that we can pick up there right now. We'll have to come back. Signal confirmed. Oh, uh, one was that seriously one scan and they knew where I was? Must be because I'm getting later into the game and there's just more systems that are in Infested, basically. Volus fabrication units. You know what? I think we found a Volus system. Oh, there's more. 200 units. Take that. Thank you very much. Holy shit. Reapers eluded. Whoa. That was quite ridiculous. They have booster packs. We're, we're gonna read the summary for this planet. I think this is a Volus system since we're picking up Volus Intel assets and it seems like this one has a summary. Book of Flenix. The bonus, the Volus homeworld is a high pressure, high gravity planet that supports an ammonia based ecology. Nice, a rune. Volus culture lacks the romantic views of war found in the galaxy's more aggressive species. There you go. So you guys can read more about the Volus there. Let's go ahead and get the fuck out of the system. Faster than light. I don't know what happens if they catch you, and I don't want to find that out either. The Anos Basin. <laughs> Almost looks like a noose. For any of you guys that watched Deacon Sundry's Co-Optitude, you'll know what I'm referring to. There's a fuel depot here. Sir Kesh. Wait a minute. Have we come here before? Let's go ahead and pick up the fuel. So, it doesn't look like I can scan for anything in the system. I mean, I could sit here and scan all day and just nothing will come up. I think that I've... I don't, I don't think I've gone to the Ismar frontier. We'll go ahead and visit here. I know that this one, I think this is going to be a little bit of a shorter episode, but we're really doing the best that we can, picking up as much as I we can. Something. Well, at least the Reapers are not in the system yet. Advanced biotic implants. See, we're gonna have so much to do when we go on to the Citadel. Oh, 100. 100% of assets acquired. Or recovered. So I think that was really the last system that we had. Let's just take a real quick look around. Um, obviously, we don't 
want to go to the far room yet. We'll be going there soon. Ninma cluster. I think I've covered all of the clusters for now. So in the next episode, we will be going back to the Citadel. And like I said before, that's probably going to be a few episodes there so we can finish up a couple of the videos. Or, uh, I'm sorry, a couple of the missions. Okay, you guys, so I want to thank you so much for subscribing, liking, commenting, and I will see you in the next video. Stay tuned.